from gas is slowly but surely returning to stations all across Georgia, even after Colonial Pipeline experienced yet another hurdle. Just yesterday, Colonial said its internal server had an outage, but things have since been fixed. The company says the disruption is part of its restoration process. And the latest data from Gas Buddy shows less than 38% of stations are still without gas, but that's compared to more than 50% on Friday. So a little good news, right? And all new this morning, we're sharing some tips to protect you and your family from having someone hijack your online accounts. Jerry Carnes, who is actually showing us how to do it beyond just changing your password. Hackers are getting more sophisticated as they try their best to disrupt your life and take your money. There are some relatively simple things you can do to protect yourself. For advice, we turn to Dr. Andy Green, a cybersecurity expert at Kennesaw State University. He tells us the passwords we use for email or online banking are typically too simple. Complicated passwords are difficult to remember, but there's a solution. Password managers create and remember. All of your passwords are centrally stored so that uh, the only complex password that you need to remember is the password to get into the password manager. In addition to a password, multi-factor authentication uses your thumbprint, facial recognition, or a text sent to your phone to confirm you're the person trying to enter a site. Sometimes hackers will try to change your password. Many sites won't allow it until you've answered a question like, what's the name of my oldest child? A hacker may may be able to find that information on your social media accounts. So when you're setting up security to protect your password, use a little deception. Give your third child's name or give them a fictitious name that, but something that you'll be able to remember. Dr. Green says unless you're ultra wealthy, a hacker won't spend a lot of time on you. If you make it difficult for them, they'll move on to the next potential victim.